In this video, I'll show you how to fix the two main causes for the media offline error in DaVinci Resolve 18. We've all been here before, but there's no denying when this little frustrating media offline error pops up with its terrifying dark red background and warning sign, a little bit of panic sets in as we've just spent hours editing a video, and now we think it's doomed. Luckily though, once we've regained our composure again, it's actually pretty simple to resolve and restore again, turning those frowns upside down. Let me show you how. The number one cause is when you've moved a file to another folder. Say you're working on an edit and after importing a file from a folder on your computer, you've then later moved that file to another folder or even changed the file name, possibly due to better file organization so that you can locate or remember them more easily in the future, right? Well, if this is the case, DaVinci simply can't locate your file anymore because it's disappeared from that original folder that you imported it from. Therefore, you have to relink your file again, letting DaVinci know where your new file is now located. Within the Edit or Cut pages, if you come up to the top left of DaVinci, you'll see this little chain looking icon called Relink Media. Click this and the following window will appear giving you a couple of options. If you've moved your file and you know exactly where it is, then simply press Locate and once you find a new location, press Open and just like that, your media offline worries should be gone and the anxiety restored to a normal level again. If you've searched for a while and still can't locate your file at all, then it's time to use the option Disk Search. This will perform a more in-depth search of your computer hard drive. However, it's worth noting that if you have a lot of files on your drive, then this option could take some time. But if you get your file back at the end of it, I'm sure it will be worth the constant sweating as you wait. Now we'll move on to the number two cause, accidentally deleting a file from your media pool. If you've got a lot of files in your media pool and by accident you've pressed backspace and deleted one of them, then this will also show up as media offline on your timeline. All you need to do is locate it again and bring it back into the media pool and this will solve the issue straight away. However, you can't do this the same way as the first method by clicking on the relink media button as it will show up saying zero missing clips, even though we can clearly see there is. In this case, you will have to import it manually using the shortcut Command plus I on Mac or Control plus I on a PC and then locate your file again, press open and all will be back as it was again. Crisis avoided. Have a great day folks.